Hi, and welcome to the last lesson in this section. Fandanjo is a Spanish traditional tune, and it uses all the bass notes that we covered. So I'm going to play the song on 60 beats per minute. It's in 3-4 time, so there are three beats in every bar. One, two, three. Well, I hope you like this one. It covers all the bass notes that we learned so far. About the right hand, I played the whole song with my thumb. Again, um, I recommend that you, you use the thumb for this one because it has the sixth string and it's kind of hard to play the sixth string with your index and middle finger because uh, there is no upper string to rest your fingers on. Okay, let's start from the first bar. A, C, E. So, open, third fret, second fret on the fourth string. Now you can leave the second finger here and add the first finger to the B. So let's play this one more time. And then we have an eighth note on the third bar. And again, keep the second finger on the E and add the B or the first finger. And repeat the third bar again. And then move on to the next bar. Start with the G. And the next one is a little bit tricky. Starting with the F, and then the third finger on the C, and then the pinky on the F. Now you don't need to keep the first finger on the F. You don't need to do this. Because the time of the F is one beat. So you can play the F, take it off, play the C, and then the F. And then the next one is E, B, E. And then A, C, F. Again using the third and the fourth finger. Now about these two, if you put the third finger here, the pinky might buzz because it's not going to be on the fret. It's going to be on the metal fret itself. So you need to make some room for the pinky so it doesn't buzz. And then E, B, E. And then we have a kind of like a scale, starting from A, the fifth string open, A, B, C, D, E, F. The 
count is one and two and three and to this chord which is an E minor and repeat the same scale again but this time we're going to keep going after the F it's D same string open E C D B C so let's try these two bars together Play it again, slower. And then we keep going. A, <clears throat> B, G, A, F, G. One more time, those three bars. I know it's a little bit tricky. Don't worry about the speed now. Focus on getting the notes correct. Okay, here we go. Three, four. to the E minor chord A C E G B D and again this one F C F and finishing with E sixth string fourth string Fourth string, second fret, of course. So I really hope you liked Fandango. This concludes uh, this section about the sixth string. And uh, I strongly recommend that you take your time with this one because all of the ledger lines, do the exercise, do the drills, uh, try to memorize Fandango, make your fingers uh, play the sixth string notes and the fifth string notes until you get more comfortable with them and I'll see you in the next section. Bye